Hi. Today I have a very interesting product with me. These are Unreal 8 glasses which I ordered from US. These glasses cost me around 379 USD. Imported pieces in India cost around 43 to 50,000 INR. This is a portable display without power backup of their own. So a host device is required either Android or iOS which can power these classes. The list of compatible devices is present on Xreal website but in practice any device with USB-C with a display port can provide power and display. If you live in an Apple ecosystem like me you require some other additional components as well such as the Unreal adapter along with lightning to HDMI adapter. These glasses looks like a normal Ray-Ban wafers which are a little heavier than normal glasses but much lighter than VR glasses. In addition, they will give you privacy when traveling on flight or in metro. Another use case is if you want to enjoy your OTT content without disturbing your partner at night. For me, this works as an additional display for my MacBook to increase productivity. Let's do the unboxing. Unreal Air comes in a nice cover to protect and carry them around. We will talk about these later. Let's see what else is in the box. We have some manuals and a QR code to download the Nebula app for Android and Mac. The AR experience is currently limited to Android devices only. There are extra notebooks that you can choose according to your nose size. We have a prescription lens frame, which is a nice addition. So if you have a weak eyesight like me, you can take these to an optician and get custom lenses made to fit into Unreal glasses. There is a black cover for the glasses that can reduce light further to give more immersive experience. Let's look at the glasses now. My first impression is wow. Look at how normal these glasses look. No one can easily guess if you are wearing AR glasses. On one arm, you have the power button and volume rocker which also act as a brightness control. You can see these bulges which houses a micro LED panel that reflect into these periscopic lenses. So you are not directly looking into the screens. Here is a proximity sensor. It will detect and enable the screens when you wear them. The quality of the case is very good. We have a USB type to type C cable to connect your glasses to a phone or a Mac. This is a braided cable which feels strong. Let's connect my iPad and check if I can show you the internal display. You can see the mirrored iPad display which may look small but once you wear these glasses you get a 130 inch display that is just 6 feet away from you. The arms of these glasses are adjustable so you can adjust them according to your face. Now, everything changes when you want to connect an iPhone or a gaming console. You need the Unreal adapter. It has a 2600 mAh battery, which can power these glasses for approximately 3 hours. You will also require lightning to HDMI adapter from Apple. Let's unbox the Unreal adapter. We have some manuals and the adapter itself. The adapter feels sturdy, made out of a good quality plastic. Here is the HDMI input, which can be connected to gaming consoles. On the opposite side, we have a USB Type-C port, 
which will connect to the air glasses. To connect an iPhone, we need to remove the attachment. Here you can attach your official iPhone's lightning to HDMI adapter. Let's open an iPhone adapter and try to connect. Here is the adapter. It looks like the Unreal adapter is made for iOS in the first place. See how nicely they both fit together. This USB-C port will also be used for charging this adapter. My primary use cases for buying these glasses is portable external display for my Mac for increased productivity, content consumption while traveling or when I don't want to disturb anybody. Last but not least is gaming. For a laptop, you can have three displays. I will try to record some videos, which can be difficult, but I will try to show how content looks through these glasses. Here you can see my 42 inch TV. And now look at this. It's a massive 130 inch screen for me personally. Here is my Mac and the Unreal glasses gives me three screens. The middle screen is mirrored from laptop. The right screen is playing YouTube. And on the leftmost screen, the app store is opened. An interesting factor is that I'm also connected to the real world because I can see other objects as well. If I put this cover, you can focus on the tasks you're doing. Unfortunately, I don't have any Android device with which I can connect these glasses and show the Nebula AR experience. Perhaps I can do that in my next video.